Hello and welcome to Tribe Topper. I'm Sonal Gupta and this channel is about increasing your understanding of physics. To clear your concepts, subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon for latest updated videos. In this video session, you are going to learn about the exchange particles. See, we have learned that various particles like leptons, baryons, mesons, they interact with each other. So they interact through one or the other form of a force. We have learned about four fundamental forces and all the four fundamental forces have variable ranges. Some are short range forces, some are long range forces, some are very short which act within the nucleus. So they definitely have different pair of particles which through which the force is mediated. So that force which happens between a pair of particles, it is mediated by the exchange particles and those exchange particles are given the name of gauge bosons. So because the four fundamental forces, they have different ranges, so there is a different boson which is responsible for each force. So let's have a look at the various fundamental forces and the exchange particles that are responsible for their uh, force mediation. So gravitational force happens with the ex help of exchange particles called gravitons and this acts on all particles. If we talk of weak nuclear forces, they act only on the quarks and leptons which exist inside the nucleons and for them the exchange particles are W plus boson, W minus boson and Z zero bosons. Then we have electromagnetic forces which act on electrically charged particles and their exchange particles are the photons. And for strong nuclear forces which acts on quarks and gluons or quarks and hadrons, the exchange particles are gluons and mesons. So you have to remember these exchange particles for these particular forces and the particles on which they are acting. So that's all in this video session where you've understood what exchange particles are to be considered because in the next video session you're going to learn about the Feynman diagrams which will use these exchange particles. Thank you.